Namaste and hello my friends my name is Amit and I'm going to tell you how to install Ubuntu when your system crashes using Windows 10, 10 Pro or any other. This is my Lenovo G5030 and I have my booted CD of Ubuntu 14.04 LTS. So I'm going to install Ubuntu in my Lenovo G5030. So let's start. This is my CD and this is the BIOS of Lenovo where we are installing our BIOS setting. Then all you need to do is to move up this PLDS DVD using F5 buttons or 6 depends on the system you have. For doing this uh, all you need to go is to exit and uh, save changes yes and exit saving changes system starts normally booting from the CD this is the Ubuntu starting booting here it started booting from the CD Now we can see these two options try Ubuntu and install Ubuntu. Better to try Ubuntu and then install. Now hit try Ubuntu. You can see the desktop uh, of the Ubuntu where we are trying to see how Ubuntu works. Now if you like Ubuntu trying some options in this like searching all over open the files my system is a bit slow so mm, these are the options the options volume keys states calendar settings Wi-Fi connection as you can see enable Working. Now we are directly going to install Ubuntu 14.04.3 LTS which is lifetime service or long term service. Double click on it. This is the initial move where it is asking for your language selection. I select English and go to continue and hit continue this is the second stage where it is asking for 6.6 gb available drive space and some power backup and it may be connected to internet or ethernet any of the external media we use are connected here you need to go to install third party app softwares because Ubuntu surf supports many of the third party softwares. Now go to the continue and hit. Here my system is not plugged in for its power and it's not connected to any ethernet or internet. So it's not needed to select this one download updates while installing this is the third page where it is asking for errors disk and install Ubuntu and uh, these two are the supporting options for this one are different options for selecting or uh, choosing different installation type it's better to choose something else that you can do of your own customization 
click continue here I have four partitions in my windows uh, where these drive DV slash SDA 3MT FS is an empty drive I can use it for installation of Ubuntu now I am detecting this drive partition to make a free space now you can see that I have some free space of 90.6 GB uh, we need to partition partitionate three partitions for installation of Ubuntu one is boot and one is slash and the last one is swap so let's start go to free space go to add the window pops up let's ask you for your size the type logical or beginning of the space use for swapping is I use for swapping is only 1 GB that is 1624 MB and select use age use as and all you need to go down swap area that's it press ok this will create you a swap area of uh, 1623 MB now second partition for your boot add it logical drive select the size I'm going to select 8000 that is 8 GB and uh, leave it like this mount point to slash press hit ok as you can see the tick mark has been created for installation of uh, this OS uh, we need to create one more partition for this uh, which is boot go to mount point and boot hit ok Now make sure that uh, you're going to install your OS in the main drive which is of um, in my system it is of 500 GB so I selected that one and installing hit install now the windows pops up and gives you a warning of this the partition table to the following devices are changed and this cannot be undo so hit and hit continue this will start the actual process of installation of Ubuntu now select your country and hit continue uh, this is the one more window which is asking about your keyboard type so it is automatically detecting your keyboard type or else you need to detect your keyboard layout or a style which you're using in my case it's default so go to continue and hit and continue window pops up again and ask you who are you give all your details related to you I 
fill all the details of my this window or a tab and hit continue start install this OS this is the initial stage of starting installation copying all files may take some time be patient and leave your system for a while feature in Ubuntu where it comes with the three different uh, office softwares for doing some work or for the students stage uh, all you need to do is to restart here at last uh, it will ask you to remove your installation media and close the tray and then press enter it's already done you can see this and you need to hit enter system restarts at a loss for these options now all this is going to start it you need to give your password this is almost done if you like my video please subscribe gives me a thumbs up namaste and thank you for watching